This is Mats Pellbeck Sharp, Head of Sustainability at Ericsson, one of the world's leading providers of information and communication technology, ICT, to service providers. Mats is a sustainability pioneer, helping the ICT industry unlock climate action potential. In his role at Ericsson, he has group responsibility for circular economy, environmental performance, climate action, environmental management and sustainability impacts and benefits from ICT and IoT. Welcome, Mats. The stage is yours. Thank you, Katharine. It's a pleasure to be here again, I might say. Uh, and I'm going to talk about cir circularity. And, and you have heard how important circularity is for both the climate action as well as, as how important the process and uh, innovations are to reach the circularity of materials. But I will bring up some other examples as well. And, and, and three things that I would like to talk about is really the importance of understanding the life cycle impact. And the second part that I would like to talk about is really how important business models are for circularity. And the third thing is the power of digitalization, which is, of course, close to my heart. But to start then, why is the life cycle impact so important to understand? I think uh, normally we see that prolonging the life and uh, using or refurbishing and reusing equipment is the highest order. But in general, that not, might be an oversimplification because you have to understand the life cycle impact to know if it's better to use and reuse or if it's better to recycle and use the material another time. So on that note, I will take two examples to make this a little easier to understand, I guess. And that is uh, very close to us. And that is, of course, the mobile phone and the mobile network. If you look on a mobile phone, about 80% of the impact of a mobile phone comes from the production of the mobile phone. The uh, big display, the uh, printed circuit board, the processor and, and memory inside the phone takes a lot of energy to produce. While we have managed to make the, the charger very, very efficient and, and the use of the phone very small, so that is only 10 to 20 percent of the total impact of a mobile phone. If you compare that with the mobile network that makes the phone work, all the base stations and, and com communication equipment around that, it's in fact the total opposite. Around 10 percent of the impact comes from the production, while over 80 percent comes from the use and the energy to fire these networks and use these networks. So then, of course, the best thing that you could do as a private person is really to prolong the life of your mobile phone. That will reduce the total impact of, of mobile phones significantly. So one more year will more or less uh, increase uh, or decrease your total digital footprint enormously. On the other hand, in the mobile network, to use that mobile network, uh, if the equipment is so much more energy efficient than the previous generation, it might be a good time to replace that and use more modern equipment because of, of the energy consumption while use. So uh, I think that that is just to explain the difference and, and the importance of the life cycle impact. If I move on then to the business model. The business model is important because it drives the behavior of companies. So, uh, as a service business model is generally understood to be much better from a circular perspective. And why is that? It's because you internalize all the problems that you create when you design the product. So if you design a product that uses a lot of energy, suddenly you have to pay your energy bill yourself. Uh, and if you design a, pro uh, a product that you need to change a lot of equipment, then you have to, to take care of all the service and, and going out to the site and changing that. So that's why business model and service is so important. And one example of that is uh, there is a possibility for cities to buy light as a service. So instead of buy, buying the light source, the energy, and putting this up and down and changing all the light sources, you can buy light as a service. And then, of course, the company that usually sells light sources, then they have to take all the cost for the maintenance, for, for the energy, and for other things. And then they design the product in a totally different way. Much longer life for the product, less energy consumption, and less maintenance maintenance is needed because that is their own cost and they have to design the product in a different way than when they have a linear model selling new products all the time. So finally, the power of digitalization, and of course that is 
hugely important for, for, for circularity. But why is that important for circularity? Well, I can give you just one example. Uh, we have talked about peak oil for 25 years or more. But I will talk about peak Kodak. And what is peak Kodak then? In 1999 was the peak of selling film for cameras. And since then, in less than 10 years, the film sales went down with 99%, thanks to digitalization. That is the power, the first step of the power of digitalization. At that time, it was replaced by small and relatively unqualified digital cameras. All digital cameras has now more or less gone down with over 90%, and that is the power of the mobile digitalization, because now people use their mobile phone to take their pictures. And now, also, more people can take more pictures, they can have shared memories. I remember when I was small, you had to save the picture, and then you often missed a good moment because you had to wait, and, and because the film was expensive. So, the cost was in relation to the consumption. In the power of digitalization, the cost is not related to the consumption in, at all in the same way. So, you can use your equipment much, much more, and it doesn't impact. And I think the power of digitalization, in short, is really the best way to save resources is to use no material at all. And that is the true meaning of power of digitalization. So thank you. I will then move on, I guess. Excellent, Mats.